Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I achieve these three drag through marble effects. Before we get started, on the screen will be a list of all the gels used in this tutorial in order to achieve this exact look. If you want to follow along with me, pause the video and grab the similar color gels that you have and we can get started with the tutorial. So we're going to start off by grabbing the colors we're going to use for our marbles. The colors that I'm going to use are a turquoise, a light blue, a dark blue, and a silver mega diamond glitter gel polish. As well as a silver holographic diamond pot gel. The camera unfortunately doesn't really pick up the holographic aspect of this gel, but Zaza is running a special from the day this video comes out until the 30th of September. The special is you can buy any eight of the nano diamond gel colors and get a fabulous 20% off. Check out our social media for what else is currently on special. And finally, black and white gel polish. So on my nail, I have one layer of my dark blue gel polish so I'm going to grab my glass tile and with each of my gel polishes I'm going to make a dot of each color that I'm using. Then using a liner brush I'm going to pick up and apply the colors in a diagonal flow. I recommend putting contrasting colors against each other. You don't need to clean the brush in between colors. The extra colors will create a more detailed marble. Overlapping colors is advised. There are no real rules to this type of marble, but practice will make perfect. After applying all of my colors, I'm going to use a liner brush to start dragging the colors through each other to create a marble effect. I clean the brush every so often so I can get some thin lines, but this is not necessary. You can also have some glitter or clear gel on your brush, which you may find works better for you. You can also add some of the gel on the tile left behind to add certain colors in areas that the color may not be, or if you want more of one color in a certain area. Don't over marble, it's very easy to with this technique. Once happy with your marble, cure for 60 seconds in an LED lamp and then apply glossy top coat and cure again. For the second nail, I'm going to repeat the exact same step, except it's all going to be done on an uncured layer of the blooming base gel. As you can see, the blooming base is going to give a feathered edge, which in marbling makes it very dynamic because you start to have sharp marble lines next to more feathered marble lines. For the blooming marble, you don't need to marble as much or you will make the blooming base redundant. Once happy, cure, top coat and cure again. And finally, for the last nail, I'm starting with a bare nail and I'm going to apply large splotches all over the nail with each different color. A base color is unnecessary but can be used if you would like to. Once all of the splotches are applied all over the nail, I'm going to take a liner brush with some of the Nano Diamond Glitter Pot Gel on and swirl my marble. I didn't marble very much for this technique because I wanted to show you that even a little bit of marbling will give you a stunning marble effect. This technique is really nice if you want to emphasize certain colors as you can leave these colors relatively unmarbled. Once happy with your marble, cure, top coat and cure again. And there we go. That's how I achieve these three drag through marble nail designs. These naturally look good with a gloss top coat, but even better with a matte top coat. The crispness that matte gives to the marbles is undeniable. For all that have been watching my How to Marble series, this will be the final installment of that series for now. And I thank you very much for watching them. And I hope I could help you learn how to marble. 
Be sure to like and subscribe and hit that bell icon if you want to keep up with new videos. Stay tuned for my next video on my rainbow glitter acrylic ombre stiletto nails and my next art tutorial series on how to ombre with nail gel, all coming in the next week. Thank you so much for watching. Have a lovely rest of whenever you're watching this and I'll catch you in the next one. Toodles!